uh, Corporal Antic, and I'm the crew chief of Amphibious Assault Vehicle 103. Hey, buddy, go. All right, go. The Marine Corps and the MU utilizes us to uh, transfer infantry personnel from ship to shore. We have smoke generation systems, so when we're going out and we're about to hit the beach, we'll flip them on, create a smoke screen so the enemy can't see us. Once we hit the beaches, we let off the infantry and we'd follow alongside of the ground units. We would use our 50 cal and Mark 19 to provide maximum firepower. An AAV is a direct reflection of the Marine Corps. It pretty much shows how amphibious we are. When I first saw this vehicle, I honestly thought it was the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my life. But if you take care of it, it's going to take care of you in the long run. Sergeant Upsler, with two four scout snipers, chief scout. Something as complex as aerial sniper, you need to build that chemistry between two separate entities. Not only do I need to be intimate with my weapon, I need to be intimate with everything during the five phases of a mission. Every day I get behind my rifle, I learn something new about myself, I learn something new about my weapon. Out here in the ocean, you know, we were just using ammo crates and some dyes. A small target, aim small, miss small. People ask us to provide eyes and ears to a CO, a company commander, a battalion commander, and we do that, we do that very well. When everyone looks to a sniper to take a shot, they're not expecting a miss. They're expecting 100% accuracy all the time, every time. Oh, we're about to extract.